Hi, my name is Jenna Roller, and this is my project on my interviewee. Um, my project is titled Oppression in the Hispanic Family, and this is my um, website that I have created for it. So the, first of all, the first page, it tells you about my title, and I have a couple of inspirational quotes. But first off, my second page is going to have the person I interviewed. This is a little bit about him personally and his demographics, um, just to explain to you a little bit. Um, the interview, the person I interviewed, I am co-workers with. He is a 22-year-old male, and he is a Hispanic a, and a second-generation uh, American. Then, if we go to the next page, is childhood life. This page talks about um, three different things. This is his activities, family as a value, and his family dynamics as a child. This is my first. Uh, topic I chose to write about because he had some differences from the typical Hispanic family. Um, first of all, he was um, involved in a lot of physical activities and things like that, like athletics and um, sports, things like that in his childhood. Um, the second thing was that he, he um, really values his family, which is pretty common in the Hispanic descent. He um, really thinks that they are important and spends a lot of time with his family as well as um, in his church. That's another value that he really liked to express during our interview. The third of which is family dynamics. Um, and in his family it's a little bit different than the typical Hispanic family. His parents were the only people that were allowed to discipline him rather than other Hispanic families. I, I researched and saw that in many families, the entire family, extended family, and even close neighbors or friends uh, were also involved in disciplining the children of the families. The second topic I chose to talk about is relationships in, 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 a, in a Hispanic household. Excuse me. And the two things I decided to talk about with these are dating and then playing with friends. First of all, dating. He had some issues when he was dating as his mom was a the primary caretaker in his family and is very protective over him and wants the best for him as any good mother should. But it, it is to the extent that it actually hampers his relationships and does not allow him to go out as much as he would like to. And the second topic would be playing with friends. And this topic is quite similar to me personally in that he was only allowed to hang out with his other friends when there was a parent around when he was younger. Um, there was also um, something that I researched that was that Hispanic mothers are more likely to discipline than Anglo-American mothers. Um, and I believe this shows that it's very typical for his mothers to be protective and disciplining as his is. The third topic I am talking about today is discrimination. And he had an interesting situation in his childhood. He went to a primarily African American school um, for high school. And while African Americans is another minority as Hispanics are, he was actually discriminated against because he was a Hispanic, which is very interesting in the whole range of oppression and things he went through. Um, throughout high school, he really struggled with not receiving positions in sports and re rejection from um, romantic relationships. And he was actually made fun of because he was Hispanic rather than African American. That's the last topic I chose to talk about. This is my conclusion. Um, my conclusion states that he loves his culture and while he grew up from from different than other Hispanic people, he um, really endured a lot of the trials that Hispanic people face in our everyday society. I also learned that there's very, many differences in each household with each family, um, that no family is going to be the same and no individual is the same. 
in that they're all, they were all raised differently and all have different values and beliefs. Um, that is my conclusion. And then I added in a slide for all the questions that I asked him as well as some little short snippets of his responses. So thank you for listening to my presentation today. I hope you enjoyed my website. Once again, my name is Jenna Roller, and this has been my HGFS 3350 interview project, Oppression and the Hispanic Family.